here, Len Alter here. How you all doing? What I want to talk to you a little bit about today is the use of spark testing equipment in various plastic constructions. Again, one of my favorite examples, chemical tank. Okay. Let's say you're making your tank. It's all welded up. You've tested it. Everything's looking good. But all of a sudden, you put chemicals in and you find that, hmm, I have some leaking at various spots. Okay, so you want to check what is going on here. Or you might even want to check it before you put the chemicals in, which some people do. Point being, use one of these babies. It's called a spark tester. What happens is, plug it in, put it at the right setting, and you'll move the tip up and down along the weld bead otherwise known as weld rod that's uh, been laid in place. And as you're moving it up and down, if there's a space, an air hole, a gap, anything, which you might not see with the naked eye, what's going to happen is a spark is going to come out of here. You'll know that that's where there is potential for a leak. So you'll then go back and re-weld your plastic, make sure again that there is no leaking, and then you can go home. Take care.